dear diary, I still remember the time when I was a boy. I had married a treat and had a romance I could never forget. She made me complete. Together we had a happy life with a not so happy ending. It wasn't death that ended us, but our own fear and anger from how it all happened. Our hearts were shattered in trauma, and what was two became four. I was reborn in the same village I lived before, and my old self was there as a shard of my soul that was no longer myself. He reminded me about my past romance, and our heart was still glimmering with the flames of love. I was ready to live the same romance again. But I had no idea where my true love was. So I learned witchcraft just to be able to find her. And to my surprise, she had been born very far from my village. I was weak. I did not accept that I would have to live an entire life alone, imprisoned in flesh and blood. So I decided to end my journey. I had thought that this would stop my pain. But it only made it worse. I could no longer connect with my other self. I was going astray. Years later, when my love found me, he was feeling guilty for being born so far away. But our love was strong. We planned a way to find each other, and we were back to the flesh. Everything was going as we planned, except for one little detail. He chose to be born male again. But I'm not gay. Why was he born male? I need to wake his other self. Maybe he could help us understand. I got a soul that needs your attention immediately. I'm chatting with him right now, but he doesn't listen to me. I have something important to do right now. This is more important. It's almost time for him to be born again and he's still living a fantasy. We need to teach him about love before his next journey. Can't I do that later? No. There are other lives depending on this, so get him to the school before it's too late. <sighs> Did I mention that I have a job? I'm not going to school, bro. I'm in paradise. Let me just chill and relax, bro. Listen to my guardian. He's just trying to help you get ready. The future has good probabilities for you. My future? My future is right here for eternity. So you don't even want to get born again? Why should I? Things are a bit chaotic down there. Why am I going to start out over again if I'm living a good life? I can just stay here and chill. I'm doing too many things right now, so I'll let you handle this. Don't leave him until he's at the school. Aye. And there's a hearing for your boyfriend as soon as he's lucid. You can give him a goodbye. I wish you two peace and good. Dude, he sounds bossy as f Listen, I need you to go to the school. They really need to give you advice, and I have something very important to be doing right now. I didn't die to go back to school, bro. You wanna join? I can't leave you. You're coming with me. What? Is that your house? What? Oh, I should be sleeping here. Oh, there's a dog here! Wake up. I need you to wake up. OS. Hmm. Hello. Snap out of it. I was meditating for years. Why were you born a male? My guardian told me once that the hardest path becomes the easiest. I'm serious. Why? I can't tell you yet. Then you better do something because your breathing self just told me he's not gay. Were you dating him in his dreams? Yo, can I take the dog? No. Who is this guy? Long story. Well, we need to think of something. If he doesn't start a romance with my breathing self, our connection will get weaker. We won't find each other in our next life. We can't force someone to be gay. Forcing him to be someone he's not would backfire. Then what are we going to do? Well, I'm going back to sleep. He needs you. Which is why I'm going back to sleep. If I stay awake, I'm consuming his mental energy. He needs me inside his heart remembering who he is. We don't know if he will remember. I need to trust myself. But as far as I can tell, this is only half the battle. Your breathing self is not very fond of guys, is he? Are you still unable to contact him? Then you have to go to sleep too. 
but your breathing self needs me. He needs your breathing self more. You can't touch him and give him what he needs to live a happy life, but your breathing self can. You can't contact him, but you still share the same heart. My heart. I know. In your sleep, you'll be closer to your breathing self. It is from within that you can do the biggest transformations. I'm scared. I don't want to lose you again. I learned something while I was meditating. What? To be patient. I love you. I love you too. <sighs> you got two boyfriends? That's kind of f***ed up. I sense they're talking about me in court. Let's go make a visit. My pending vote was a no. It's a tie. Which means his guardian should decide whether or not the girl stays with the human. I believe we already know what he wants. My vote is for the girl to stay. What? You're the one who opened this case to separate the two. The real reason why I was trying to separate them was to prevent you all from thinking he's not letting his friend have a girlfriend just to keep the girl. I heard him myself. This is what he's doing. This is what he thinks he's doing. He's stupid and disrespectful and immature. But I've watched him for lifetimes. I hate to say this, but his love is real. Perhaps in the past, but he's no longer the same he once was. The human doesn't want his soulmate. That is not true. Ask him and you see. Tell us, human. He's my friend. A romance should make your friendship even stronger. I already have a romance. Your girlfriend is one with your friend. Not really, they have different personalities. Her personality is simply a memory of how she was in her last human life. And that will also be gone one day. It is the heart that stays, and they both share the same heart. And the same eyes. If you get to know your friend more, you see how similar they are. But I'm not gay. Is he referring to the sexual orientation of his vessel? Yes. Then find him a female human then. I don't want another female. I have her. She's not in your reality. I can date her in my dreams. For your whole life? I love her. She won't be able to stay with you as soon as your friend finds a partner for him. I won't let him then. See? This is unacceptable. Do you want your friend to live alone his whole life just for you to keep her? No, I don't. There must be a solution. Yes, there is. We can split her connection with your friend. I heard it's pretty weak already. Will that work? Yes, there will no longer be one. Your friend will be able to carry on with his life while you can still keep the girl with you. Okay, but who is he going to live with? I can find a good partner for him. Someone that's going to take good care of him. Will he be happy? He won't be sad. So it seems that's what the boy wants. Let's vote. Do we all agree to split their connection? Looks like you got what you wanted, human. <laughs> Why are you crying? Isn't that what you wanted? No, I, I don't know. I just want to be happy. His mind is conflicted. Give him time. We all know transformations are never comfortable. Let us wait then. I'll take him back to his planet. you're feeling human. I was human once, and like you, my soulmate was also born male. Were you gay? I'm not sure. My body perished before I could find out. I gave my life to save him when I was still a kid. Then how did you have so much love for him while so young? It didn't happen in a single lifetime. Our love grew stronger each time we breathed the air. I guess my love isn't that strong then. I just saw you crying after we said we would split your friend from your girl. This wasn't your reasoning. It was your heart remembering. Remembering what? Remembering the love you once had with your friend. He was one with the girl. He might be too shy to say, but he loves you as much as she loves you. In all your lifetimes combined, they were the one who most loved you. I remember you were truly happy at that time. But I was a girl back then, wasn't I? Yes, but you had the same heart, the same essence. If you let it expand, you know 
notice the love to transcend even the desires of your vessel. It is the purest form of energy, unexplained even to us guardians and strong enough to do miracles. This is so confusing. I have seen many cases similar to yours, human. Many souls have refused to live a happy life with their soulmates because they did not accept the conditions of the vessel. When they wake up, they're filled with sadness for having wasted an entire life without ever experiencing true love. I wish things were easy. It never is. Life pushes us to find the best in us. Sometimes it even breaks us and splits us to let us find the diamond hidden inside. But if you learn to see the world with the eyes of the heart, you could once again live a romance as intense as the one you lived before. It is what your heart is craving for, and I'm rooting for you. Thanks. I wish you peace and light. I was waiting. Whoa, what happened? He just woke up. That's rough. So I was hearing all the chat about soulmates and stuff. Do you think there's someone down there looking for me? I don't believe anyone is destined to be alone. Uh, I guess I was a bit lonely in my paradise. Uh, maybe I should check out the school stuff then. I'll take you there. Good luck with the boyfriend drama. I don't know what I would do if my soulmate is another dude. <laughs> you won't get a life plan that you cannot handle. I'll take my chances. Thanks for the help. You see, I don't really need the body. When I'm alone, I can be formless like the waves in the sea. But sometimes symbols can help me focus. When I was a human, I used to climb to the top of a mountain to look for answers in the stars. Some old habits remain even after death. I spent the next seven days meditating until it finally struck me. OS was right. Whoa, I can see your diary in the book of life. This is private. Let me take that. I was looking for you. I know. What is this creature? That was Pikachu. He just evolved. Mm. I was thinking, do you think it could be pansexual? I don't even know what that means. Stop trying to find a label for yourself. Just be you. Every time I think about my friend having someone else, I feel sad. It's like I don't want to lose him, but I don't know how to even break the ice. I don't think he's gay or pansexual. And this is all my fault. I've spent so much time here in your dreams that I left him without my presence. If he's you, why can't you just talk to him? Our connection is damaged, but there's a way I can be closer to him, and maybe he will listen to me. How? If I go back to sleep inside his heart. No! When you cried that night in court, I saw OS in you. It is OS sleeping inside your heart that is helping you remember. I need you to do the same for me, or he might not accept your love for him. But I need you here! And I want to be here with you. But like your other self, I need to be patient. If I don't get closer to my breathing self to wake his love, I won't be able to find you in my next life. I need to sleep to make sure I don't lose you. Somehow I think I can understand now. You're evolving. I reunited the fire of love you had for me. Now it's your turn to do the same for me. I don't know how to start. I don't want to screw this up. Just be you. I trust you can do it. This is hard. I need you. I will be there, inside my breathing self, feeling what he's feeling. And hopefully one day he can be myself again. I love you. I love you too. I wish you peace and good. Dude, should I be in this class? Oh, sh there's an alien here. <laughs> if I tell people this story, they're gonna think I smoked some 